<laughs> Alright, look at here. This is uh, a Sig Sauer 220 Dark Elite. It's in 45 caliber. They're a pretty good weapon, but you got trouble right here. The rear sight is no good. They're uh, actually discontinued my Sig. Uh, some people, this is not the case with this one, but some people say uh, that the tiny little, I'm sure you can't see it, but right, there's two tiny little Allen heads. It's like 35 thousandths, uh, 0 0.035s, and the adjustment over here is 0 0.050. Uh, what? <clears throat> that's some tiny Allen wrenches. You, you know, that, that's that's not common things that you'd have laying around. Uh, why would you want that on a pistol to start with? Second of all, it's a little cam system. The Allen head turns and there's a little cam system for your elevation up and down. That's the trouble with this one. Uh, you can zero it. Perfect zero. And it'll climb high. First couple of shots. Three or four shots get a little higher. And then clink, it'll come over and drop the side all the way to the rear and you'll be firing six, eight inches low. It's at 25 meters. So, you know, I moved it out just playing around at 70 yards and the difference is like firing completely over uh, the target by six foot, you know, in some cases when it all, climbs all the way to the top versus, you know, hitting the ground, you know, 10 foot short at others. And that's, set, you know, that's, that's just, this will not work. So... I contacted SIG, of course they got a full warranty on everything, but they want to hold the gun four to six weeks. This is a customer's gun. I'm, for those of you that don't know, I'm David Gaddy with GMF, I'm FFL, SOT, I do a lot of class three stuff. I also sell just about anything anybody wants. So this customer is hot. He, he is uh, not happy at all about his thousand dollar handgun and that's giving him a deal, uh, being defective, basically can't hit a bull in the ass with it. So, Sig wants the gun to come to them. Mm -mm, not four to six weeks. That's their turnaround time. This would not happen. So, um, today I was contacted back by Sig, and we met in the middle, I guess in the middle, come to a compromise anyway. Uh, what I was wanting was for them to ship me a set of fixed Sig light night sights. Um, and basically me ship these to them. They could verify when they got the site that it's trash. It was a bad idea. They know it's a bad idea or they would not have discontinued that site. So anyway, they wouldn't do that. They had their policy. They have to have the pistol in hand, evaluate it to replace them. So I say, this can't happen. I can't hold the customer's gun up that long. What is the best thing we could do here? And so he offered me dealer's costs. Um, I'm not going to get into that, but it's it's a very good price on a set of sights. And he said that's the best he could do. It's cutting me off. You know, the very best dealer's rate he could cut on the sight. And uh, he'd cover the shipping, you know, and I've got the equipment to install them. Uh, also, before you get any bright ideas, oh, I've got one of them. I'm just going to get a rear sight. The front sight does not regulate with a fixed rear sight. It's too tall, so when you put the fixed rear sight on, it's gonna put your point of impact low. Okay, so you have to have the complete set, the front and rear sight. So, my point to this is, the Dark Elite is a fine, fine weapon. I mean, it's one of their top end guns. Uh, I actually changed the grips off of this one. The grips are so perfect that you wouldn't want to carry it. It's, it's a nice aluminum machine, laser engraved grip that you just wouldn't want to beat up. So I changed it out for a set of hogs. But anyway, the pistol is great. They just um, had a faulty sight. And it's my understanding some of the stainless elites have them too. So anyway, if you have one of these and you're having sight trouble, or if you have one of these, you're going to have sight trouble if you fire it much. So uh, contact SIG. You know, you can even tell him, GMF, you know, went through this, you know, uh, got him out in firearms, you know, and he called in, you know, didn't want his gun held up, cut him a good deal on some sights. Um, say, can you please do the same for me? Can you send me some sights? You know, at a reduced cost, I'll put them on, you know. Uh, maybe they'll work with the public too, but 
like I say, great gun, a shitty sight. Oh, go ahead and think about that. I'm out.